Shouts to that woman that defended herself. I would have preferred to see her pull off a lot faster than earlier, but she didn't. And as she stopped after she was assaulted and the gentleman continued to come to her vehicle, she lit him the fuck up. Now, some of you may say she shouldn't have shot him. He's a lot larger than her. He's already assaulted her. I don't know what state they're in, but a lot of states have rules that if you feel like your life is in danger, grave bodily harm or injury you can get busy few lessons there one don't stop two lock your fucking doors as soon as you get in them and three don't engage with these people don't let them your doors unlock you engage in and you don't pull off that's a recipe for disaster because she drove out of there fine i don't just mean it's a recipe for disaster for her you may have to take somebody off of this planet and you're not ready to anyway guys we go over these concepts in two classes one understanding imminent threat which is fridays as well as we go over some of these techniques in our firearms basics class which is wednesday you should register you should be in the class to be informed and know what to do it's only twenty dollars it's over at solutionaryuniversity.org i'll put a link below register and sign up for the class just having the firearm is not enough it's not a talisman that's going to protect you from the werewolves you need to know what to do, how to avoid, and we help you with that. Hope to see you all in class at solutionaryuniversity.org. Be safe, be solutionary.